I just it's uh Does living at a higher altitude Does she say something? She might say something. Hello, Commander Shepard. Uh -huh. Yara will be pleased okay. to see I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. Bye. Anyway. It's a little weird to me how calm some of my friends are. To be fair, they don't really go into this in the games, but Liara is actually critical to the reason you're still alive. Like, it's her that helped locate your, like, the rem your remains. There's a whole comic on it. Um, which is why she's having to do the Shadow Broker thing, because she worked with another Drell, um, to basically get my remains back. And, and then she did actually give them to Cerberus, um, because they were the best equipped to bring me back, I guess you could say. Oh, where? Oh, where? Shipping and cargo. Where am I? Yeah, it's through here. Man. At least I think it is. I think up there there's a club, and that's it. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Corosa family. Asana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. Lucky I got out at all, for mercenaries were starting to shoot. If she lets us back in, I'll get it, I promise. If not, well, we'll just have to hope. That was a Thane Krios announcement, I'm pretty sure, that I just missed. But this is important. Excuse me, I'm on an important call. Alliance military officials are having difficulty meeting hiring quotas, according to a new report. Since even Prime, mm -hmm. an initial surge in patriotic enlistments was followed by a downturn, as the public became skeptical that the Alliance can match against technology. Ilium is really nice, but it, it is just a nicer, prettier colored uh, Omega. Never check, never check. Serena? Who wants to know? Name's Shepard. <sighs> Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. I'm just out here with it. Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Just tell me what you know about him. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. <laughs> I'm so excited. If you work there, you must have an idea what his opposition will be. Eclipse Mercs. High-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. I thought that was just a rumor. Well, you know what she's capable of then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. She uses it to keep her friends in check and her enemies dead. So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers, penthouse level of Tower One. And now she's working as like a cargo person to make ends meet. <laughs> she's a security woman. There's a second tower still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. It doesn't sound like Nisana is just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. It's kind of like, it's kind of like, why are you doing all this? But also, like, I don't think this woman is necessarily like an upright paragon of virtue, but she did take issue with Nisana murdering people to keep her secrets. Um, and, and instead of, which, this is weird to me, though, Nisana would have had her killed. I think, instead of just firing her, because, like, she, like, this is a loose end. She has other people killed for smaller infractions, so it's a little bit of a plot hole, in my opinion, but maybe she couldn't take this woman down, because she's probably really good at her job. I'm ready now. Oh. That's what I like to hear. We'll go tonight, as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, 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 on this one... 
probably don't want to bring- I want to bring gears. Because <sighs> Garrus has some tech, Saeed's a soldier, I'm a biotic. Eclipse Merc should have mostly shields and robots. This should be fine. Sure. Also, I don't know if I like the collector rifle. We're gonna go with the Vindic- I cannot, I cannot talk. It's been, I have literally been playing all day. <laughs> Except for a few brief breaks. towers are heavily guarded and you'll find more resistance closer to the pentos so this assassin you planning to stop him i'm just here to make sure he survives hmm it's interesting why she would help me when she thinks i might be there to stop them um there they are I, the dante she Pentos. seems like she just likes we'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the pentos she just enjoys chaos Her will fight you every step but it's your best chance like, it seems like she just, like, literally wants to throw a bunch of grenades into this Nasana's life and just watch them go off. Why don't we just save time and take the shuttle up? She's got mercs with rockets just waiting for you to try. You get maybe halfway up before they shot you down. Besides, your assassin won't go in that way. Best to go in low. Alright, let's do this. Hold on. <laughs> You can't just fly willy-nilly, you maniac. Don't linger too long. They'll be here to greet you soon enough. Thanks. Good luck, Shepard. She truly just seems like the kind of woman that wants to see what happens, the outcome. Me and the squad. This is just unreal, honestly. That she can she shouldn't be able to get away with that, but she's got enough money that she probably would. Firing an impact shot. Oh, I forget. Warning, hostile force using non-standard ammunition. Oh, you noticed. They were hiding when we came up. Probably saw that. There we go. Oh, goodness knows I need the money. a hacker woman. Look at me go. I'm, just, I'm always, I forget, but I'm always hacking people's stuff. Each area really does feel pretty unique. Like for the main missions, it's really cool. I like it a lot. I got you, bud. I got you. Help. He's still alive. I can't feel my legs. My chest is killing me. Who did this to you? And why? We're just night workers. Nasana sent them after us. She sent the mechs to round us up, but we didn't hear. They just started shooting. They just attacked you? Yes. They were too slow. It was horrible. Everyone screaming. The mechs said there was no time. Asana wanted us out of the way immediately. Then <coughs> the dogs. <coughs> He's not going to make it if we don't help him. Here. That should ease the pain and keep you alive until help arrives. Gotta keep moving if you want to find this assassin. Take your time. Yes, Dad. I think I'm better. 
Find the other workers. Help them. She's just freaking... She wanted the area clear because she had an idea that Thane was coming for her, right? At least I think that's what it is. She had an idea that something was gonna happen. And so, like, instead of just ignoring her workers, she, like, wants them to clear out to the point of shooting them so that it's just a bunch of dead bodies around. And, like, I'm pretty sure these aren't, like, they're not indentured workers. Like, they're actual employees. Like, they're not, they're not indentured slaves. Like, which would have a contract of some sort, at least, that she should keep. And, like, th but they're also just employed. Like, I don't know. Like, it's just so dumb. It's so dumb. She's a terrible person. I need to get up to the penthouse. Any suggestions? Take the service elevator to the upper floors. The bridge between the towers isn't finished, but if you're careful, watch out for the mercs. They're everywhere. Any idea how many mercs Nasana's got? A lot. Dozens of them are wandering around here all day. You'll find more the further up you go. Why would Nasana kill her own workers? To her, we're expendable. But I didn't realize she was that ruthless. My friends, co-workers, slaughtered. They were jumping off ledges to escape the dogs. Brutal. Like, it's unreal that she thinks she can get away with this. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Like, if if, Th if Thane's not gonna kill you, I am. You know what I mean? Like, it's just, <laughs> it's just unreal. Unreal. I hate these things. Sorry, concussive shot. Actually, let's switch things up. We'll have Garrus go on the sniper. Nice. Look at that little dog. I would legitimately love to have one as a friend. Oh, that's right. I have cryo ammo. Let's, let's try cryo ammo for a bit. Okay, to yeah. worry about. I was like, is he not gonna kill that one? Look, see, that's what happens. I love this rifle. I love this rifle. Why am I not doing? Okay, I was like, maybe just needs to do the impact. Oh no. This will put him down. Oh, that didn't that didn't do what I wanted at all. Oh my gosh. Garrus is just taking him out with headshots. Well this worked across the Oh nice it does. Oh Oh, I think it got hit by the Oh. Oh, I think that got caught up in the shockwave. Which is why it was weird looking. I think that's my blood on the wall. Standing out there. Never saw me coming. This is actually really nice, especially if he stays back like that. Because for some reason, I feel like when I generally have snipers, they decide that they're supposed to be on the front line. And I'm like, why are you doing that? Oh, I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> I was like, as I was walking past it in my head, I was like, I should not walk past that, <laughs> and then I did. So scary. <laughs> this will put them down. Can I switch back? I'm all cryo. Firing an impact shot. And the. Loading ammo, this. Ah. Oh, yeah. 
I know. Hell yeah is right. I'm stuck on a wall. Hell of a shot. Garrus is a hell of a shot. True. There's a couple gun schematics in here somewhere. Further on. This reminds me of like a platform just like this, I think, in Mass Effect 3. It's like endgame hey, type I think stuff. He went in here. We'll go get him. You go. Get your ass in there, and the Santa's not paying you to send. Fine. But I... Uh... <laughs> oh. Stuff's going down. We are... We are the, uh... We are the full frontal assault. It's, it's, a, it's a pinchered attack. We're the full frontal assault drawing most of the attention and then Thane can run around in the background murdering people from above. So good. Concussive shot ready. Just wait till I give him the widow. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. Excuse me, I need this space. Shoot their limbs off. Oh wait, you're still alive and you're trying to get out. Oh my goodness gracious. You know, I think out of all of them, the Eclipse armor looks the best. Like it looks the coolest. Blood pack is like a blue egg. Uh, I mean blood pack's okay. Too many of you. Oh, see, I'm freaking. to get his disruptor ammo back. Because for some reason... Oh, did he? Oh, he's already got it on. Good. Okay.
think this was just another way in. Yeah. No? Oh, whoop. What? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is the way I came. Okay. I'm trying to climb it over. More of you? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. We have to be careful. We have to make sure we get these rooms. Please, don't kill us. We'll go, we'll go. Hey, look, they're not Eclipse. You're here to help us, right? It's one reason I'm here. Come on out. It's safe enough. Thank you. We are in your debt. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for someone, not a merc. He's on his own. Well, whoever sealed us in here. When he found us, I thought we were dead, but he just closed the door and locked us in. Locked you in? Sounds like our assassin was trying to keep them safe. Assassin? Here for Nasana, I bet. She's got it coming. You treat people like this, it always comes back to bite you in the ass. The sun is not exactly your favorite person. She's a hard woman to work for. That's an <laughs> understatement. She works as long hours, no overtime, and this is what you get in payment. She's unpleasant, to say the least. Why not just quit? We would if we could. What's stopping you? Our contract. We're stuck until the job's done. Quitting for any reason can be hazardous to your health. We hear that anyone who leaves early tends to disappear. Probably just a rumor. But who wants to find out for sure? Mm. Did you see the one who locked you in? Do you know where he might have gone? He's no Solarian, I can tell you that. But I have no idea where he went. <laughs> he's no Solarian. So, if he's after Nasana, he'll be heading to the upper levels. I should have a picture of him in the dossier. I probably wouldn't know what he looks like, but they're just kind of keeping the suspense up for the player. <laughs> How many workers were in the tower? Are there many more of you? Not alive. We were lucky. Well, some got out before the dogs were sent in. Maybe a few are hiding somewhere. I need to get to Nasana's penthouse. What's the quickest way? Cargo elevator is the only way up right now. They're still working up top. Watch your step. Some of the walls aren't in, and it's a long way down. Cold, too. I hate working up there. Well, and she shouldn't have them doing manual labor. Solarians are not built for manual labor. She would have them as tech workers, I assume. Maybe that she has them wiring some stuff in up there, but yeah, you can't... Like, they're not built for, like, manual labor. I wouldn't stay here too long. It should be safe down on the lower floors. I was just thinking the same thing. Let's go, everybody! Some Thank of you. them and got out. assassin to aim for her head. Because she doesn't have a heart. Get moving. Take that. <laughs> He's like, I've been thinking of that one all day. <laughs> no, that's cute. Like, why not, right? Take your quip. Shoot your shot. 
there is a schematic in one of these two, but no, I don't, nothing bad happens to them, I think, if you leave them, but I don't want to leave them here, you know? Like, they don't, ooh, here we go, the Viper Sniper Rifle, I can't talk, Sniper Rifle. And the power, gimme, gimme. Man, it should let me, oops, it should let me, um, switch when I pick up a new weapon. It should let me switch it, I feel like. The only time, like I said, the only time it lets, the only time it lets you do that is with the collector particle uh, heavy weapon. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna call this one here because it ended up being an hour long because I didn't realize until too late that I once again ran over like the previous episode with like six minutes and decided to just wing it. YOLO, let's go. Um, anyway, I'm so excited. I'm so excited for this mission. It's a long one. It's a gauntlet. But we'll get there. The payoff is excellent. <laughs> so, really quick, I wanted to say thank you all for watching. And to everybody. And I really wanted to say thank you to my patrons. Specifically to my sapling tier patrons. Scalamonger, thank you so much. And Reese Galito, thank you so much. I appreciate both of you guys' support a lot. And I wanted to give an extra special shout out to Christopher, my tree tier patron. Who, as we have established, is a super awesome bestest. And I really appreciate your support a lot. But yes, thank you everybody for watching and supporting, and I hope to see you all in the next one.